Get ready for the launch of a new instant the rumor is extreme ticket. We have the best five dollar shelf on the territory. Don't forget, we sell five dollar grabs. We have an online store, www.thepotshop.online, that sells five dollar grabs. Don't forget to like and share our Facebook page, The Pot Shop. Yes, we have pot in our shop. The 420 Happy Hour at The Pot Shop every day from 420 to 520. 15% off all flour except the $100 ounces and the $5 grams. 15% off all baked goods and all our delicious slushies are only $10. 5403 Old Highway 2 in Shannonville, Tyendinaga, Mohawk Territory. Come see what everyone's so happy about. Every day from 420 to 520. You are listening to Real People's Radio 87.9. This is Mohawk Buds Talk with AB, Triple D, and B Dub. Yo. What's going on tonight, guys? What's going on, boys? What's going on? Oh, snap. Uh, <laughs> all right, so tonight we have a few things. Um, we have owner's choice from the pot shop. Okay, so what was suggested was Astro Boy. So Astro Boy is, tell us about it. B-Dub looked it up for us. Astro Boy, 70% sativa. Yeah. 30% in the couch with a THC level of 20%. 20%. Is that, yeah, you can definitely feel that. So it's a hybrid sativa. It's a hybrid sativa, and you can definitely And to feel make that. this strand, <clears throat> it's a mixture of Apollo 13 and Cinderella 99. Nice. Cinderella 99. Strand. So you looked this up beforehand, right? Mm-hmm. So can you tell what what's Cinderella 99? It's just uh just a heavy 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 kush, but it, the way it was describing it. It's uh one of the old kind of older, not an OG, but it's an older strand. Uh same with Apollo 13. Um and it's it's it's, it's a great uh strand by the sounds of it the apollo or sorry the astro boy gives you quick relief according to the thing very uplifting and it's great for if you uh believe it or not have asthma or uh, depression but the one big one that i noticed on there was it's good for ptsd not ptsd that see you know that's probably why i like it (laughs) yeah again keeping with the mental Health mm-hmm. awareness health. and uh, everything we're doing this week towards that, so that's fantastic. And that's a huge one too, the PTSD. Absolutely, absolutely. It is. Like we have many patients that come for that. Mm-hmm. I got mm-hmm. a few buddies that that suffer from that. Mm-hmm. You know, uh, we suffer know from the, the we <laughs> suffer from that. Right? The land back guys, you yeah. know what we've seen. You know, from the police violence to being shot at to. Everything, everything. You know, so right, so we have a medicine for that, and Astro Boy seems to be a good he's, go-to. He's pretty good. Yeah, yeah. So the owner's suggestion from the pot shop that was a good one. Mm-hmm. So you can get that online at the pot shop dot online, or you can go in to the pot shop. It's open twenty four hours a day, seven days a week. If you can't make it there, they deliver from nine a.m. to nine p.m. Right? Mm-hmm. Correct. Right. Sweet. You know what else you can get there? What else? Two row there? coffee. You can two always get two coffee. row coffee. There. Always. Bum, bum, bum. always. Hot. Hot. Eastern fresh. Door Mild. So I named it Eastern Door Mild because it's a Mohawk coffee company, right? And we're the, keep, we're the keepers of the Eastern Door. So it only makes sense to have one of the most uh, uplifting, energetic coffees that we have named for the Gunyagahaga people. Mm-hmm. That's fantastic. Right? So it was... Yeah, uh, it was Honestly. like a, it was a shout out to the Gunigahaga people, you know? Mm-hmm. So every single one of our things, had, there's a meaning behind it, behind mm-hmm. our coffee. Because it's not just a coffee company. Mm. It's where culture and coffee connect. Boom. That's awesome. Right? That's awesome. So? Learning while drinking coffee in the morning. Th- nothing, nothing goes better. What better thing to do? Right? And then starting on Thursday mornings from Two Row Coffee Company, we're going to start the Two Row Coffee Company Cafe. Wow. Oh. Yeah, so in the mornings, you'll be able to go in here and tune in 6 a.m. between 6 and 10. We'll be playing some podcasts, some uh, news, some updates, things like that. So nice. be able to drink your coffee, enjoy some of that. Have a good or laugh. Have a, have ca- a good laugh. Have a lot of good laughs. 
and you know have one of these yeah. this uh oh, this you astro always boy, have one of these this astro boy is a good one to maybe even kick off the day oh you yeah know? for sure like, for sure and then while you're going ahead and doing that you can go to realpeoples.media check out all the news there too so mm-hmm. you can get fully updated on everything no awesome. thc the 20 percent. Do, do you boys feel it already oh yeah well I got to be honest with you, I hit mine there first, oh. so I'm hitting, that one's hit me a lot harder. Than <laughs> than <laughs> so, we're on different ends of the spectrum right oh, now. Oh, for sure, for sure, for sure. <laughs> you guys are up there, I'm kind of down there a little bit. <laughs> right. So, Triple D, what you brought in tonight was GMO cookies. GMO cookies. GMO cookies. Yes. Tell us about this. GMO year. cookies is 90% indica. Oh, no wonder you're way down there. <laughs> 10% sativa. So it's, again, it's a hybrid, but it's one of the OG hybrids. Nice. Nice. Yes, it is. It is a cross between Chemdog, a very, very potent strain, which is for the uh, cancer patients as well. And it is also a cross between that and Girl Scout cookies. <laughs> I think yeah, I, every, that one's a good one. Oh yeah, that everyone loves school. Girl yeah. Scout cookies. Old yeah, 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 exactly. An OG strain as well, right? Yeah, yeah. So both of them are both indica dominant mm-hmm. as well. So it follows through into the hybrid strain that I'm smoking tonight, the GMO cookies. It is very tasty, aromatic. It is very euphoric Ooh, and uplifting. Aromatic. Aromatic. But at Ooh. the same time, <laughs> it is relaxing. Nice. And it helps control inflammation. And the big one I found, B-Dub, in this strain is the stress relief. Good. I stress think I relief. even yep. Yep. hit you there and was yep. like, you know what? That's awesome because, you know, it was a long day for me today. Mm-hmm. And hitting this right away. I needed to come here, you know what I mean? Not here tonight, I needed to be a little bit here tonight. Yeah, like, you you came in, and just, you know, up here stressed out, right? Yeah. So, when I was just like, yo, you know what, you need to shift over. (laughs) And get ready. You know, know, shift, and you'll be good. Shift change. So, you know, he hit that, and then complete you know it took away that ah feeling oh absolutely absolutely i was even chuckling with b-dub here saying you know what this works this stuff (laughs) works works. it's doing its thing (laughs) right it does what it does and and medicine right right i I, we use this for medicine i was flustered i'm not gonna lie now i'm having a great time yeah join you two guys our show this is awesome yeah, awesome. so, you know, uh, when we can tell it's really good, like Indica or something like that, we need to use the triple D eye scale. We'll zoom right in on your eyes, <laughs> and, like, however, like, oh, he starts again. The oh, triple yeah. D eye scale. Yeah. <laughs> this is the triple D guarantee. The <laughs> triple D guarantee. Yeah. Yeah. Head there over. Yeah. Um, when, when we're done the show, check on Instagram. <laughs> at Mohawk Buds Talk. Stamp yeah, triple there, D guarantee. Yeah, there's a picture of triple D on there. Oh, it yeah. yeah, you can tell it was a good night. Yeah, for that sure. was a good night last night as well. It's a good night every night. It's a good night every night. What are some of the strains that we've gone over so far this week? This week alone, to my recollection, now you have to <laughs> give me a moment here. Just gotta go back a little bit. Yeah, go back <laughs> a little bit. I believe we tried the Orange Barbara was last night. Orange Barbara, Barbara, Orange Barbara. Barbara, and then that we, got intense. Yeah, <laughs> then we had um, crazy. <laughs> <laughs> oh man we, <laughs> we had uh, another tough one the blue cheese blue that cheese. was blue the beginning cheese. of the week i believe that was uh yeah yeah that was that was a tough one to start the week off with but we're doing indicas this week so yeah. that's what we were doing we it was did... definitely an indica oh yeah <laughs> yeah yeah and then we also did on the triple d i scale it was great oh triple d guaranteed that one <laughs> <laughs> yeah and uh i believe we did the raspberry cheese raspberry yeah raspberry, raspberry cheese. cheese another heavy indica uh and then uh, the last one we did was you gotta help me out be dub i forget it now man right there barbara no we i got the barbara you got Barbara. I got Barbara. I picked her up already, Barbara. Yeah. <laughs> you know what? I believe I'm not going so to So we lie. went with 
Indica last week, or no, sorry, Sativa last week, Sativa last Indica week. this week, Indica so I'm predicting week. a hybrid week next week. Uh, it might week. be a hybrid week next but week. But you know what? We have a lot of stuff that we have left over. So you know what I Imagine think. like 15, 20 years ago, we having having leftover weed. I can't imagine that. No. I can't imagine that because it was so hard to scrape along. Yeah. You know what I mean? And then nowadays, it's so easy to go find your strains at the pot shop or any other kind of facilities uh, that we have at Bear Medicine. We have Robert there that can help you out. We also have our slushies that you can get. I don't know what just happened. <laughs> <laughs> Barbara. Barbara. Barbara happened. That was Nate. Yeah. Other Nate. Food. Food Nate. Yeah. Food Nate. Oh, you know what? We had premium garlic. That's it. That's premium the platinum. garlic. Pla- speaking, platinum garlic. speaking of food. Yeah. <laughs> speaking of food. Well, that was a good that was a good cue thing right there. Yeah. Um, so I was thinking tonight, because I had a heavy indica, you know what would go delicious with this heavy indica? Tell me. I gotta say tonight would be delicious for some pie. Oh. Dude, it's always good for pie. But not just any pie, a layered pie. Oh, come on, stop. Here's something and, else, man. And not just a layered pie, but a chocolate layered pie. Chocolate. Which look, in look, French, as you're talking. Which in the French they call actually a tort. A tort. Oh, a tort, yes. A tortier. Tortier is, pie, yes. Yes. Tortier pie. Or you can uh, get a chocolate, you can get caramel, you can get, uh, they're, they're famous actually in for their butter torts butter torts with pecans is pecans. where i'm thinking of going and then a maple drizzle over top you can have your pecans i'm partial to nuts <laughs> i'm partially nuts too yeah well we already <laughs> knew that man come on but you're sitting with us then no matter what you gotta have whipped cream then too oh, right hey. and nothing but beats homemade fresh whipped cream that's a hard one to do not really. No? No. Says the not, professional shit. Not when you know how to do it. No, there you go. <laughs> yeah. See? Triple D. Triple D guarantee. Natural. <laughs> That's the only one I know. No, yeah. no, no. It's... Oh, okay. Yeah, even I was going to do that. Haven't you watched the show, man? No, I'm talking about the can, the can you shake up. That's oh, only, but... It's the only whipped cream I know. No, B-dub, I'm telling you. Once you have real whipped cream, you're going to be like, what was I eating, yeah. man? Like, no, legit. Yeah. Legit is so good. So good. He whipped it real good. I whipped it real good. <laughs> so I like to uh, stop by um, Shop Fresh every so often. And today, or yesterday it was, I got the uh, Pink Gorilla. Okay. And, yeah, that was an indica. And B-Dub did a little bit of research for us. Mm-hmm. Right on, B-Dub. Yeah. I was like, hey, this is really good. And I always get a indica for myself. Like, I'm just a heavy indica smoker as it is because that's what I, I know what I need. Right. You right, know? Right. So um, I got that. B-Dub, so you want to tell us a little bit about it? Yep. Uh, with the research I found, Pink Gorilla is 75% indica, 25% sativa, uh, THC is 21%, oh. which is pretty, that's kind of booming. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's weird, but it's good. Yeah. <laughs> like one percent. And okay. this is the cool thing too. Okay. Uh, it's made with gr- two strands. Yeah. Yeah. Gorilla glue number four. It's decent. Good. Decent. And pink 2.0. Really? Yeah. Heavy, pink heavy 2.0. kush. No, that is a heavy kush. Big time heavy kush. Kush. And Gorilla Glue has a, a nice sativa kick to it mm-hmm. as well, so that must be where the sativa is coming through in, yeah. from the Gorilla Glue number four, yeah. Yeah. which you can find at the pot shop as well. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we have Gorilla Glue four there. Yeah. Yeah. So this uh, this pink Gorilla, you can find it at Shop Fresh, but all the rest of the strains that we're talking about, um, except for another one I'm going to mention shortly, can be found at the pot shop. That's awesome. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And you can find all these at the pot shop. I got the GMO cookies at the pot shop. We have that brand new. You know what else you can get at the pot shop? Is two row coffee? Yeah, it's two row coffee. And a shatter bar? Yeah, shatter bars. Wow, look at that B dub. Mm-hmm. Have you ever Special had a shatter treat. bar before? Hey, do you want to know something about that uh, pink gorilla too? What's that? I'm kind of avoiding the question. Mental ecstasy. Oh, oh yes, I knew. You called it. You called it. 
<laughs> B-Dub legit sat here earlier and said, I can picture him right now when he sits down. He's going to go like this. <laughs> but he's going to go, oh, B-Dub. Oh, <laughs> B-Dub called it. You know what? You earned yourself yeah. a piece of chocolate. You Ding. did. <laughs> you earned yourself a piece of chocolate. That's some B-Dub. good stuff. Mikey Norris was in here earlier, and he had a piece of that. And he what also brought... Sativa or Indica? He this also brought a treat. Check it out. Oh, what did Mikey North bring us now? He brought us Glueberry. No, he didn't. Yeah, he dropped it off. He said, here, try this out. I picked this up. He's brought it in as a choice for us. Well, you know what? Yeah. Shout out to Mike E. North. Thank you, sir. Yeah, and you know what? Is You're cool. solid, man. You know what's cool about this one, too? What's cool about is this one? It's a big, Quinny natural. No way. Yeah. Homegrown. It's homegrown. And you know what? I love blueberry. Blueberry is one of my all-time favorites as well. Blueberry. Glue. Oh, blueberry. My blueberry. bad. Blueberry, yeah. My bad. Yeah, so... Well, at the end, we're gonna bust up a little bit of that and try that out. Oh, well, got a nice smell. To yeah. It. In the meantime, why don't you grab that over there and give that to him because mm-hmm. he's right in the spot again. He is. B Dub has put himself in the position again. Well, he doesn't Bust. smoke. He doesn't smoke. What are we smoke, doing though. here? What flavor? Um, flavor. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna flavor. go with the. I'm gonna go with B Dubs. Give me some of B Dubs. I'll try that one out. No, that one's me, B Dub. That one. Yeah. That one's him. That's Gmo Cookies. Gmo. Okay, so these shatter bars, you can find that these at the pot there. shop as well. Um, you can also, can you get them online? You can get them online as well, absolutely. You can get all our edibles online. And um, yeah, we deliver 9 a.m. to 9 p.m. You can find all our products online at thepotshop.online. Thepotshop.online. You can also go to tworowcopyco.ca get all your merchandise for the credible mohawk there as well we've got these sweaters and they've got it on the back too and look at this that's tight down 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 down, down, down. down, there we go that's tight people that's tight and good quality sweater too keeps you warm yeah man so um this blueberry he dropped it off we're gonna try that out a little bit later nice speed up i'm looking forward to that one some people have not heard yet um the difference between smoking and actually taking the edibles like we talked about a little bit how you know smoking does help with like your mind like how you're saying how it calms you down Mm -hmm. you know like you were going a little bit ape earlier and then you know you went down to monkey and now you're back to human now i'm back to normal yeah Yeah. gets me an even keel right so you got you you got you there and like helps your mind Mm -hmm. helps your body too absolutely and then you were describing yesterday how it, when you have an edible, it kind of pinpoints where there's like physical pain. Yeah, mm-hmm. big time. That's, but I mean, that's a personal preference. Um, I'm gonna say that because you know everybody's different. You yeah, know, absolutely. Somebody yeah. like if someone takes a, smokes a joint, they may get the same thing from doing a bong. Yeah. Whereas yeah. when I have my edibles, like this is the first time I've had a shatter bar, so it's gonna be like woohoo. Oh yeah. But yeah, you know, because uh, shatter even too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so. So, uh, you know, it, it's going to be one of those things where it's like, okay, where did it go? How did that feel? Like, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. So far, it's... <laughs> like everywhere. Kinda, right? Yeah, it's kind of like yeah. I can feel little things everywhere so far. Yeah, little because uh, the it's the shatter, so that is a um, more intense mm-hmm. of THC mm-hmm. infused into the chocolate. Nice. So yeah. we've talked about distillate. We've what talked about mean? flour. Like, we've talked about sugar, we've sugar. talked about these different things, so tell us about Shatter, Nate. Shatter is a concentrate of cannabis that, now not to get into the scientific... Well, yeah, thing. get into it. Well, a little bit is... <laughs> kind they, of, kind of, don't kind, like, go kind crazy. Kind of is they basically... Oh, sativa too. Yeah, is they uh, use... So I could keep you awake. Uh, <laughs> an alcohol oh. to boil it down into... Um, like a sludge, I guess you will, and then you cook that out. But you, you go through a few different stages now before you hit shatter. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, first so you're, you're gonna start off with um, the um, sauce, mm-hmm. and then Saucy. then you're gonna go to the live resin, which is or sorry the diamonds uh, sauce, then diamonds, then live resin, and then shatter. You know what is really good? What is really good? <laughs> that and chocolate. The that shatter and chocolate, yeah. it's like it's so good. It's, it's fantastic. It yeah, is and like I like I say when you I can get feel like it already in here. Mm-hmm. yeah, like when I get the brownies or like the baked goods and stuff like mm-hmm. that, I can eat the whole thing. 
mm-hmm. you know, with the shatter bars. You got to be careful. You got to be careful with those because, like, with that. Okay, How they have you. <laughs> <laughs> I did tell you. <laughs> you got to listen. Yeah. <laughs> and no, and, but it's it's uh, if you just got to be willing to accept what's gonna happen. You know what I mean? Like it's yeah. it's. That's why we always say too, like just take a little bit at a time, yep. a little bit at a time, a little yep. bit. You know what yep. I mean? You're because right. you You're may right. take that first little bit, and it's like I don't feel nothing. Take that just that little bit more, and, and that might throw you. Yeah, that yeah. might throw you over the edge, right? Yeah. So you got to be careful, especially with the shatter, mm-hmm. because it is a high concentrate. Like I said, that's the end of the road, right. but it's still very, very potent. And right. unlike with uh, weed butter or anything like that, I like the shatter and the still. It's better. Because you do not taste them as much, and they're not as as intense of a flavor as marijuana. This here, though, I ha- it has a very strong taste of marijuana. Yeah, I noticed. Is the that the stickiness? Bar. Yeah, and that, even a little bit of the taste too. It might. Well, be see, that's one of the things we the... talked about too, right? Mm-hmm. Is like when you have the edibles, you're more used to like clo- clothing or cloaking that mm-hmm. taste and different things like that. So where that this is made in a different process. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Right. So yeah. you're gonna get that taste a little bit more. Yeah. yeah. You can smell it, too. Yeah. Yeah. You're not supposed to be just playing with it. You're supposed to eat it. Well, I gotta, I gotta like do everything. I gotta tell everybody what exactly it does and feels and tastes. Yeah, but right? like for me, like I don't know because maybe I'm used to smoking it so much. Yeah, you wouldn't taste that though. I don't taste that. No. no. Well, I'll be like a person that smokes cigarettes. Yep. Right. Yep. That first time you take a first haul off a cigarette, you you blow your head off because it's such an intense thing you're it inhaling, is. right? Yeah. And yeah. just like, oh. Yeah. You can get, <laughs> I remember as a kid when I, well, I mean, an adult when I started smoking. <laughs> 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 Anyways, you're still it was a like kid. a head rush. Yeah. yeah. You know what I mean? Like so. Yeah. But at the same time, even as an advanced person, I still would like tend to. Wander on the careful side of oh, the yeah. shatter products. So. Yeah. Right. Yeah. One of those bars I can have for. Though. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. Concentrated anything is going to be intense, right? Right. That's why I shop for the sativa. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Right. Because, like, yeah. I knew, like, I have indica that I'm smoking mm-hmm. that I had smoked already. Um, I didn't know what you were bringing in yet. So I was, like, kind of like, you know, got to play it safe, mm-hmm. you know, because I want to still be awake and alert and be able to do 21 milligrams you know. per piece. Yeah. Yeah, wow, yeah, that's, that's some good stuff. Bombing. Yeah, five hundred milligrams for the whole bar. For the total, yep. Right, wow. you can get these at the pot shop. You can totally nice. get these at the pot shop right and now. online at the pot shop dot online. They Just deliver in this area in the Bay of Quinney area. Bay of Quinney area. That's right. Twenty one. Yeah, it's on, delicious. Boys. Hang on. Hang on. <laughs> he's going. <laughs> he's going. Hang on. He's, he's there. Dumb. Be Starting dumb to sweat. There. Starting to sweat. So. It's time for the Triple D Munch Out. What do you got for us tonight, Triple D? Triple D. Oh, my goodness. You know what? I got to say tonight, boys, we got to go donuts. Donuts. Ooh. Donuts. Jelly donuts. Please Jelly. Please, uh, oh. The problem with all this is, oh, sorry, I don't mean to cut you off. He's got to start bringing this shit. In. Oh, we're going to. We're, 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 we're doing it soon. We're going to do it soon. You just wait for The viewers down. will be like, you know, man, you keep talking this sh- stuff, but I don't and, see it. Uh, and you know what else we're going to do for everybody? We're going to take all this stuff. We're going to make sure it's written down, all the recipes, and then after that, you'll be able to find them on real people's media. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. And soon, B-Dub, we will be doing these live. Yes. Right, yes. because this guy, you have to remember, Triple D... He is a professional trained chef. Yep. He knows his stuff. Yep. And yep. when he starts describing food, he is painting a picture. You yes. can tell this guy is going to get haga by I, the way he talks, by oh the way yeah. he speaks about it. I like, try. I try. <laughs> you know, I, I took pride in my work. I'll, I always take pride in my work. So I always try to give it my all because you want to know something? I would never cook anything for anyone. I wouldn't eat myself. Yep. Exactly. Yep. Right? exactly. I remember my grandmother saying that if I don't like it, I ain't going to force nobody else to eat it. Absolutely. Exactly. Absolutely. And and I believe it's the ways with all of my ways that I go about my business is I try to give it my all. You go all in. Like, yeah, the ganyang gehag away. That's right. That's That's it. That's our our whole way of life is work. That's our whole way of thinking. (laughs) Her motto, though, I tell you, though, uh, she said she said that, but she used to cook liver, too. Ooh. Yeah, so my pa liver and that. onions. Uh, I mean there there is ways to mask it. 
to eat liver, one of the ways is in pate. Yeah, I've heard of that. Pate isn't bad when you have like the crackers and like you have maybe some cheese and some kind seasonings of, yeah. and then like green onions and stuff. I remember as a kid though, she'd make me eat it. I mean, I had like a hundred pounds of ketchup on that just to. Uh. Oh yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> I remember my granny. She made me liver too, but she made it with uh, onions and bacon. Oh, there you go. Yeah, yeah. that wasn't that bad at all. Bacon probably pulled some of that. Oh, big time, taste big out, right? time, yeah. big. Same with the onions. Yeah, big time. Big no, time. I love onions. I love yeah, onions. Yeah, I too. do too. What's wrong with? Don't onions? give me liver though. No. Well. Well, maybe. When well, you when you go through the struggle, right? When you go, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah. you know what the struggle. <laughs> not even remember, funny anymore. When the struggle like, was yeah. like, when, dude, like last week, couple weeks ago, we had a little bit of weed and pushed into the corner of a plate, and then somebody hadn't smoked, and we're like, what's what's going on? Like, <laughs> is, there, is there something wrong with that? Like, what's, you know? Yeah. Like fifteen years ago, we would have been like, well. You know, but this time we were like, well, we got lots. Let's just. Right? Like, like, <laughs> I even said to you, whose is that? I don't know. Well, I got more here. So, yeah. we, yeah. <laughs> so like, it's, it's amazing the day and age we're living in, which is what I was also thinking because we have so many strands. Yeah. Hear me out. What if we did a blind taste testing to see how good a connoisseurs we are? Yeah. You are, because you're the self-proclaimed one. Absolutely, and we can line them up on our plate for yeah, our, all our the answers. And yeah, for our viewers to see, and you yep. can see, and then I can taste it, and if I get it, then You know what cool. would be even better? What's that? If we had food with it. If we had food with it, absolutely. All the different friggin' foods that you've named off, the cinnamon buns, the donuts, like everything. Absolutely, like we got to do this soon. Yeah, but like it's finding the time, unfortunately, because I got to deliver our stuff. Yeah, from time to time, and uh, yeah. yeah, I come here and join you, fine fellows, for their, for Mohawk Buds Talk. Mohawk Buds Talk at nine thirty p.m. Eastern time, and you can also Standard time. follow us on Indian Instagram. Time. Yeah, Indian time. The Indian time. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Yeah, Instagram at Mohawk Buds Talk. That's Buds with a Z. Buds with a Z. Yeah, Buds Talk. Buds. And if you miss an episode, you can always go to Mohawk Buds Talk, RPR 87.9 FM on YouTube. Catch up. Subscribe there. And, uh, you know, we're going to have all kinds of goodies, great stuff coming up. We have all tonight, kinds of... Tonight's number... Number three. Number three. Did you just flip everybody up? <laughs> <laughs> I know that's what I was thinking. I was like, oh, come, bro, on, come on, dude. Come on, dude. Ever, ever rude. Yeah, ever rude. Come on. Rude. All right. So this has been a good bud talk tonight. It's been a slice, boys. Mm -hmm. Right? So we've had Shatter Bars. We've had Astro Boy, which was an Indica. We've had... GMO cookies, which was an indica. Heavy indica. A heavy heavy. indica. Basically almost pure right. indica. It's hard to find. Right, and we had blueberry, which is another indica. Blueberry? But, you know, it's all good. That shatter bar is a pick-me-up. Yeah. Oh, big time. Yeah. Oh, big time, <laughs> he <laughs> says. Oh, big time, he says. Right on. <laughs> so, I got to say, man, this has been a fantastic evening again, mm -hmm. and we'll hope to see you guys next week. Yes. Looking forward to it. You're listening to Real People's Radio 87.9. That's Mohawk Buds Talk. The rumor is we have the best $5 shelf on your territory. Don't forget, we sell $5 grabs. We have an online store, www.thepotshop.online, that sells $5 grabs. Don't forget to like and share our Facebook page. The pot shop. Yes, we have pot in our shop. The 420 happy hour on right now. 420 to 520 at the pot.